Now here's that function that I've written for checking characters. That's in there now. And all I've got to do is call it within my main program loop. What I'm going to do is I'm going to call it just here underneath uh, the check length. So we'll start off with an LF check characters this time. And what do I want to put in there? Well, I need an item placed in, which in this case is going to be pin 1. And I need a string of acceptable characters to be placed in there. So that's going to be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I'm checking to see whether that is returned as false. And if check acceptable uh, check characters comes back as false, we can just have it print your pin must contain only numbers. And then we can go ahead and run that and see what happens. So it's asking me for a valid pin, one, two, three, X. You need to validate it, one, two, three, X and your pin must contain only numbers, please enter a valid pin. So that's all worked fine. Just one thing that's been bothering me for a little while is this, please enter a valid pin, and then there's no space left here. So what I'm gonna do is up here, I'm just gonna put a space in this function, like so. And then when I run this, um, there'll be a space left after this, please enter a valid pin. So that's that done.